Hello my little cucumbers. Welcome back to another Rosin Brand ASMR video. This is my desk and today on my desk we have 10 master packs of the Crow collectible trading card game. Still wrapped unopened since 1993. Ooh. I got these really cheap on like eBay. This one has one of these like big bumpy barcodes glued to it. I don't know what this is. Where is this from? Tower Records. Ooh, fancy. These all seem to be from like different places. Oh no, this, maybe these are all from Tower Records. I don't know what made, made this one so special against this, but oh well. So let's take a look at these babies. Let's bring it into focus here. Contains everything you need to play. Th that's the crow. That's Chappy. Any 
devil in combat with your crow. Looter. It is not death if you refuse it. It is if you accept it. That's from James O'Barr, the man himself. Or as I like to call him, Crow Daddy. Another deviation. Another precarious situation. Wait a minute. I think the card art is different, though. No, never mind. They're the same. Sorry. That's one of my favorite board games from my childhood. Play after any special card is played. That special card is discarded and has no effect. Change of heart. Attached to any devil has two actions. While attached, the devil is an angel. Wait a minute. Oh, so these cards are like the opposite of each other. This one, the angel is a devil, and this one, the devil is an angel. Let me, hold on, let me take a good look at this card. Oh, I, I can't really remember what scene of the movie this is from. I was trying to figure it out. Upside down. Like lightning. Play on any soul immediately after it is wounded. Even if the wound will kill the soul. The soul is not wounded. Driving beat. Attached to any soul as one action. Ah, oh, you can notice there's like plus one, plus one. I think this is a devil number and this is an angel number. Whenever we get to the fucking rolls, we'll... we'll no. Darla's home. Sarah's house. Oh, these are little minus symbols. It's hard to get on the camera. Yeah. Sorry about that, Claire. Hang out. Attached to any bystander is one action. Soul always remains a bystander. It can never become an angel or devil. Club trash. Hang out. Attached any soul as one action. Here are the rules. Ooh. Ooh, hold up. We'll, we'll take a look at these in a bit. Oh, I'm sorry, the crow. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. Invulnerable crow. Crow, you may only have one crow in play. Don't tell me how to live my life. Fun boy. Martyrdom is now the price of salvation. Famous fun boy quote. Okay, let's look at these rules. So this is actually a little pamphlet. This is one of like the major production uh, images from the film. Oh God. These are the rules, I guess. But also, these are really long. Fuck this, I'm not reading this garbage. What's on the back? Get an exclusive. Hold on. Get an exclusive limited edition game card from the Crow. Oh. Yeah, if you send in your wrapper from like the booster bag, I guess they gave you like a, a special card or something. Interesting. Very interesting. I would like to read all of you the rules, but I just do not have time. Because we got ten of these puppers to go through. We're gonna be here a while. So while I open this pack, I'll, I'll talk about why I decided to do this video. Part of it is just because I really fucking love the crow for some reason. To like an unhealthy degree. is because I've actually been watching a lot of, let's get the rules out of there, a lot of, um, like, card booster pack opening ASMR videos to fall asleep. And I don't know why, because I don't really play trading card games, and I haven't since I was, like, a preteen, I think. Maybe, 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 like, 14 years old, I'd say, it was when I kind of stopped. And, um, like, in late 
late high school, a lot of my friends got into magic, but I never really could justify spending the money. But I've always been interested in giving it another go. Maybe it's a it's a it's a time commitment and a money commitment I can't really justify right now. Unlike me spending like twenty to thirty dollars on these crow trading cards, which I'm sure is a great value. Looter. We got that one already. Deviation. Also got that one already. My SD card is actually running out of space, so I'm going to make an awkward transition. Okay, and we're back. Another duplicate. Another duplicate. Another duplicate. The loft. Hangout. Attached any crow is one action. I don't think we got this one yet, at least. Lost in remorse. Play on any soul during combat and spend five virtue. Henchman, ah, uh, my favorite character from the Crow. And never ever fear. Fear is for the enemy. Fear and bullets. Once again from the Crow Daddy himself, James O'Barr. I'm also sorry. Blend in. Attached to any bystander is one action. Discard this card if bystander becomes an angel or devil after the combat. Vision of weakness. Attach to any soul as one action. Discard the card at the beginning of your next turn. Resources. Use as necessary. This card has a virtue of five. Wrong things right. Play any. Play any time and spend 15 virtue. All souls in play are discarded. Invulnerable Crow. Yeah, that's that one again. Micah. Crime Lord. If you have top dollar in play, Micah gains plus two to AR. But yeah, as I was saying, I think part of the reason that I find these videos so relaxing. Uh, it actually relates back to uh, stuff that I actually learned from a marketing class I took in school. These card packs, and just in general, any sort of product like this, uh, you actually you notice it a lot with um, smartphones and uh, tablets and stuff. There is like a, a shit ton of money and research and energy that goes into just packaging it and making sure that the unpacking process is as satisfying as possible. It, it, it makes it addicting and pleasurable just to open, and I think that it uh, translates to ASMR. Um, so that's your fucked up capitalist reality for the day. Anyways, let's enjoy getting more cards we don't need. Delivered out of evil. Play during combat. You may change the defender to any of your other souls. Must be a legal defender. Other than a illegal defender. Gideon. While a devil, AR and DR at plus one. So I forgave her. 
And honestly, I kind of have like a weird ironic love for this thing now that I think has transcended into sincere love. But Funko Pops still suck. That's another duplicate. Skull Cowboy. He's actually from the graphic novel and was included in a few deleted scenes from the movie. Then choose and be damned. Skull Cowboy. Iconic line. Honestly, I think it was a good idea they removed him in the adaptation. He didn't really fit with the tone of the movie well, in my opinion. He's a lot better suited for the graphic novel, which is a lot more metaphysical and moody. And messy in a lot of ways, too. But in a good way. A good kind of messy that comes from deep within. Invincibility. Play on any soul as one action. Soul may not be wounded or killed until the beginning of your next turn. Shelley's ring. Ah, uh, breaks my heart. Item. Attached to any angel as one action. I'm coming home. Ah, oh, look at that. Beautiful. I really like the lighting here. Play on any soul as two actions. Soul is returned to owner's hand. Discard attachment. Ah, oh, fuck yeah. Righteousness. This is my favorite scene. When he makes the crow in, in the fire. It's so fucking dumb. I love it so much. Attached to any soul immediately after it kills another. Another set of the rules. Shelley Webster. May never become a bystander or devil. If killed by a devil, all cops in play gain plus three to AR and DR until the killer is killed. Her, I, I, so I still don't really know the rules, but I think her special ability is to be fridged, and that's kind of fucked up. But it's part of the source material, I guess. Honestly, least favorite part of the crow. But it's also, like, one of the things that makes it uh, a problematic fave, I suppose. Well, not really. I don't like the crow because the love interest gets fridged. It's honestly my least favorite part of the movie. Um... But yeah, I, it's something I put up with to otherwise enjoy the story that's full of dumb edgelord action and atmosphere. Another fun boy. We're three packs down. Seven more to go. ASMR videos. It's like low-key kind of in jest, but I always end up coming away with like an actual deeper appreciation for actual like ASMR because this shit is really fucking hard to do actually. I got a lot of respect for people that do this as like their main YouTube thing and not, you know, dumbasses like me who kind of just do this for funsies and to make weird shit. Another delivered fraud of evil, another Gideon, another one of those, another nervous. A lot of duplicates. I think there's 150 cards. I don't remember, I remember looking it up online how many there were, but we're getting a lot of duplicates here. Damn, even within the same pack. Jesus, this is a bad pack. Ooh, this looks new. Flashback stupor. Play has two actions on any crow. Affected crow may not attack and receive attachments during its player's next turn. Even up. Play as one action. Discard any special card in play. Another one of these flashback stupors. Another even up. Another set of the rules. Officer Albrecht. I think we can rule out accidental death. Famous Albrecht line. Another Micah. We have a pretty thick stack so far. There's 15 cards per pack. And we opened up four, so we, we already got a deck of 60. That's pretty impressive. If I do say so myself. Let's try ripping one of these again. I don't think the 
this is gonna happen. Yeah, fuck this, I'm just using the scissors. Yeah. 
AR is plus one. Three scum equals AR of four each. Okay, we're down to four packs, my cucumbers. You know what? Let's let's give it another try. Okay, yeah. I'm just gonna give up. I tried three times, and this shit's just too hard to open. It doesn't help that it's actually pretty hot in here. And uh it's uh it's warm. Ooh, this is the one with the thing on the back. name of that card was Velocity. I don't know if I said that, by the way. Um, 
I think that's the name of a chapter in the graphic novel. Hard to capture this on camera accurately. So shiny. Another devil, another devil's night in Detroit. Another club trash. Another Darla's home, Sarah's house. Another driving beat. Haven't had one of those in a bit. Another delivered out of evil. Another henchman. Another nervous. Another anarchist now. That's fun. Here, let's just do this. Another Darla. Another graveyard. Another blade. Another Gideon. Another delivered out of evil. I had a premonition that wasn't going to be a good pack. Alright, down to the last two. scroll again. Our final rule book. Calm within the storm. Play immediately after you draw a step. Or after your draw step, sorry. No player may perform attack actions until the beginning of your next turn.
this it's you again running scared once more we are down to three cards everyone let's pick the middle just for funsies skull cowboy again oops all right spiritual guidance play anytime exchange your crow and play with any crow from your hand Every night I burn, every night I 